It was the first Easter ever, and Jesus was alive. But later that evening, the disciples were all together, and the doors were locked because they were afraid. Why were they afraid? Because their teacher, Jesus, had just been arrested and crucified. Were they coming for the disciples next? They were hiding for their lives and they didn't know yet that Jesus was alive. So they were staying in a safe place and remember, the doors were locked. And then Jesus came and stood among them. He said to them, Peace be with you. When he had said this, he showed them his hands and his side. He was showing them the wounds that he received when he was on the cross. That must have been a huge relief for the disciples to see Jesus and know that he was alive. Then Jesus said to them again, Peace be with you. As the Father has sent me, even so I am sending you. Jesus wanted them to continue to teach others about the good news of the kingdom of God. And when he had said this, he breathed on them and said to them, Receive the Holy Spirit. If you forgive the sins of any, they are forgiven them. If you withhold forgiveness from any, it is withheld. Now, Thomas, who was one of the disciples, was not there when Jesus came. So the other disciples told him, We have seen the Lord. But he said to them, Unless I see in his hands the mark of the nails, and place my finger into the mark of the nails, and place my hand into his side, I will never believe. Eight days later, when they were all together, including Thomas this time, although the doors were locked, Jesus came and stood among them and said, Peace be with you. Then he said to Thomas, Put your finger here and see my hands, and put out your hand and place it in my side. Do not disbelieve, but believe. Thomas answered him, My Lord and my God. Jesus said to him, Have you believed because you have seen me? Blessed are those who have not seen and yet have believed. If you are watching this right now and you believe that Jesus died and rose again, then Jesus is talking about you. Those who have never seen him and still believe, Jesus calls us blessed. But we wouldn't know this story if his disciples didn't write it down. So I'm very thankful for the disciple John who told us, now Jesus did many other signs in the presence of the disciples, which are not written in this book. But these are written so that you may believe that Jesus is the Christ, the Son of God, and that by believing you may have life in his name. I've got a river of life flowing out of me. Makes the lame to walk. And the blind to see Opens prison doors Sets the captives free I've got a river of life Flowing out of me Spring up, oh wells Within my soul Spring up, oh wells And make me whole Spring up, oh wells And give to me That life abundant To walk and the blind to see Opens prison doors, sets the captives free I've got a river of life flowing out of me Spring up 